We are less than 55 days from the November general election, and in the race for Iowa's 3rd Congressional District, Democratic incumbent Cindy Axney and her Republican challenger Zach Nunn have both released new campaign ads. They have, and tonight KCCI's Amanda Rooker dissects the anti-Nunn ads and has the facts on the claims that are made in them. That's right, Steve and Stacey. The latest Cindy Axney campaign ad targets Zach Nunn for his stance on abortion. And while the ad itself is new, the claim in it is not. The KCCI fact-checked a nearly identical Axney ad last month. Once again, this Axney ad shows Nunn in a Republican primary debate last May. In the clip, Nunn raises his hand to agree that all abortions in the U.S. should be illegal without exceptions. Recently, Zach Nunn took a stand and agreed that all abortions should be illegal. Now, Zach Nunn is lying about his extreme position. After the first attack ad aired, Nunn wrote an op-ed in the Des Moines Register, arguing that the clip is, quote, out of context and cut out, quote, important conversation on protecting both the health of the mother and baby. That clip from May does show Nunn agreeing that all abortions should be illegal without exceptions. But in August, Nunn wrote in an op-ed and told KCCI the opposite, that he has supported exceptions for rape, incest, and the life and health of the mother. He voted for a 2018 bill to ban abortions after six weeks in Iowa that did include all of those exceptions. In 2017, he supported a state abortion ban after 20 weeks, that included only one exception to protect the life and health of the mother. Another ad released this week by Democratic House Majority PAC also attacks Nunn on a claim that Axney's campaign has made before. Nunn took thousands from the PAC of a Chinese state-owned agribusiness with ties to the Chinese military. KCCI's fact check last month found that claim is true. Federal election records show Zach Nunn did accept $2,500 in March from Syngenta's Political Action Committee. ChemChina, a Chinese government-owned business, acquired Syngenta in 2017, and the Pentagon classifies Syngenta as a communist Chinese military company subsidiary. While the claim that Nunn took and kept the money is true, the ad alleging that Nunn works for China is missing context. Nunn argues he's spent the last year working counter-China operations as a fellow with the U.S. Air Force and that he served as a counterintelligence officer in China. And in 2019, Axney herself praised Syngenta for, quote, powering Iowa agriculture in a Facebook post that shows her touring their facility in West Des Moines.